Hey guys! Today's video is very fun and I hope it will be helpful for other people. Because I don't have good balance and I'm not very flexible, a lot of things that other people do easily are a challenge for me. Plus, I have other things like my braces and sometimes my arm crutches or wheelchair that I have to consider. So today, I bring you a few of my CP life hacks. Before I start, be sure to like, share, subscribe, and comment. And if you have some disability life hacks of your own, please share them in the comments. The first is the zippers on my shoes. I talked about them in one of my other videos about just shoe hacks in particular, but they are definitely a CP life hack. Here they are. The zippers on the side help me get my shoes on over my leg braces. These were put in at a nearby shoe hospital and were really cheap. The second CP life hack is a two for one combo. In my shower, I have a handrail to hold onto and a stool to sit on. That's probably no surprise, but here's a tip. I also sit facing away from the shower head to wash my hair because it's easier to get my hair under the water that way. And it does well with keeping shampoo out of my eyes. Speaking of hair, I have a lot of trouble with drying my hair. My hair is pretty long, shorter since I cut it recently, but at times it's been really long and it's really thick so it takes a long time to dry. It's an even bigger struggle for me because my hand is mildly affected by my CP so I have difficulty holding the hair dryer and properly drying my hair. So to remedy that, my mom and I invested in a dryer stand where I can sit at my desk and have my hair basically dry itself. All I have to do is just turn and let my hair dry. It's also really nice because I can multitask and do my makeup at the same time I'm drying my hair. This one is less of a hack, but more of an adaptation. One of my friends laughs at me for this one, but if I make coffee at my house, I usually pour it into a travel mug, even if I'm not going anywhere. The travel mugs I use are Vera Bradley, and they are amazing. They do break more easily than I'd like, but if I fall, it stays in my hand and the lock on it is secure so nothing spills out. So now that I've driven places by myself, I'll need to get things in and out of my trunk on my own. My car isn't very tall, but the lift gate on the back is. I'm both short and can't go up on my tiptoes, so I physically can't reach the lift gate handle to pull it down, and it's not automatic. So for that, I took an old quad cane that I already had, and I keep it in my trunk. When I need to pull the lift gate down, I can use the soft handle to grab the top of it and pull it down. And in the event I was out somewhere and realized I needed to use the quad cane, it's always there. And the last one, when I go to a restaurant with counter service, instead of getting my food dine-in and dealing with a tray, I order to go so it's in a bag, which is easier for me to carry. Nothing slides around, or worse, off onto the floor. And that is my top CP life hacks I have so far. Please share some of your own life hacks that you may have, and be sure to like, share, and subscribe before you go. See you in two weeks. Bye!